Hey what's up guys it's Brian for GumballTech.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to remove the boundary in the Just Cause 2 for PC demo. Now I want to thank X Snipers on YouTube for figuring this out so go subscribe to him if you'd like. The only thing that you need to download is a copy of Hex, Hex Workshop which is available for free from download.com. You could also use another Hex editor if you'd like but this one's pretty cool and it's free. So once you have it downloaded and installed, go ahead and open it. And then now you need to open the Just Cause 2 executable file. So go to File and then Open. Now, as you see here in the title bar, this is the, the location of the executable file. It's usually in C, Program Files, Steam, Steam Apps, Common, Just Cause 2, Demo. Then just double click on the only executable file here. The next part may be a little bit tricky as it sometimes may differ for people. Uh, so go to edit and go to. Make sure the hex bubble is checked. Make sure you're starting the search from the beginning of the file. Then type in 003 F2060 and then go to go. Now if you so happen to have the same line that I do, 003 F2060, then go over to where you see F675. If you do see these two things right next to each other, you need to change 75 to EB, as you see here. Um, if you don't have 003F2060, you can also try 003F2058. Uh, this is a line that Refl X Snipers originally found for his. So, If you don't have either one of these, then you need to still go to the general area of these two lines and you need to look for all these CC's in a row and then usually about four to five lines above that you'll see F675 right next to each other. Um, you should see this no matter what no matter what your offset line number is. So if you do see F675 all you need to do is change 75 to EB and then you need to save the file if you're using Hex Workshop, it's going to ask you if you want to make a backup of the file just in case something goes wrong. So go to Yes, and then all you need to do now is launch the game from Steam. So this pretty much uh, unlocks the entire boundary, so you could go anywhere, I believe, for the whole game. Uh, there are a lot of missing things, such as bridges where you where you think there would be one, but there isn't. Uh, there's also different vehicles depending on which area of the map that you go to, so that's pretty cool. Uh, there's also some other weird graphical uh, missing things in the map, so it's pretty cool to just go see what's missing now and to compare it with the actual game when it comes out and things like that. So leave any comments or suggestions in the comments box below. Follow me on Twitter if you'd like, twitter.com slash B-E-S-W-E-E-T. And then again, I need to thank Refl X Snipers on YouTube for originally uh, finding this out. I'll put a link to his channel in the description if you'd like to go subscribe to him. So thanks for watching, and we'll see you soon.